Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we're just going to do a little day in the life video. It's already pretty late in the day, but there's some things I want to do in his room again. I feel like I'm always doing something in his room, but you know, quarantine things, what else am I going to do? Um, these baskets right here have his clothes. I have to go through them because there's a lot of six month clothes in there and those don't fit him at all. Um, he's already 10 months, so those don't fit him for a while but I want to make sure it's all clothes that do fit him put away his old clothes and all of that you know I kind of want to reorganize all of this let me show you guys so up here he has like animals stuffed animals and some toys in this basket there's like blankets and then here are his socks he still has some newborn socks in here, so I gotta go through this too. And then he has hats and gloves. I feel like he doesn't need those anymore. These are just here because I need to replant those into these ones. Just because I like how these look better than the blue and this one. My mom gave me this one, so I think I'm gonna give that, like, this part back to her. And then my grandma gave me this one, so I just wanna repot those. This one has all of his Toy Story toys inside of it besides like the Woody, the phone, and the Buzz. But he has other ones in here. Like I said, this one has clothes. This one has clothes. This one has shoes. I also have to go through that because there's a lot of newborn shoes in there too. This one has bibs and burp cloths. And then this one has extra books, puzzles, some toys, blocks some blankets stuff like that and then this one has extra diapers from when he fit in newborn and I believe size one diapers so I gotta kind of go through all of that today and then yeah he has a mess in here too so I gotta clean all of this there's like blocks it's not too bad but I just got to clean it and put it away. But tomorrow, um, hold on. Okay, so tomorrow is Sunday, and that's when I do a whole toy rotation too. So I think I'm going to start getting that ready. The baby's sleeping right now. So let's see how much of this I can all get done while he's sleeping. I have to do this and clean and who knows what else. Okay, it's going to be clean in 3, 2, 1. And it's all clean. Did you wake up? Are you shaking it? Oui, 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 oui. It's okay. Don't eat that. Yucky. Yucky. Hey. Hey. Oui.
like digging my shirt. That's not funny. Where have you been? I've been working. Cause I'm an essential baby. Just kidding. No, you're not. Well, I am kidding, but I'm, I'm a normal person. Benny, we have been working. What are you doing? This one's making a mess. Y'all see my hair? I got wings now. My widow's peak. Got a widow's peak, got my wings, and I have thin hair on top. That is the best. I'm like a straight up Mexican, like I just said. <laughs> In the beard going. <laughs> sure my dad's calling me. Hello, puppy. All right, so that one has all of his newborn to six month clothes socks, shoes, sweaters, pants, everything you could think of, zero to six months in there. This one is starting six months and up, so I put all of that in there. I did laundry, so some of that needs to get put away once it's dry in there or in there. Depends on the size. So I still gotta do that, but they gotta dry. And then, next, I'm gonna tackle this. I don't know what theme I'm gonna do yet, but I'm gonna show you guys how I figure out what theme I'm gonna do. So, stay tuned for that. Okay, first, what I do is I look through this bin. It has a lot of his like toys and different like accessory things in here that I have to use for him. And I see, like, what I have. And then I try to look for, like, similarities and things. So, like, either colors or, like, a theme. Like, this would be maybe water theme. Or, like, the sea, ocean, pond, something with, like, water themed. Um, or I was thinking maybe I could do, like, a music theme. Mm. I could even do like a recycle theme with like recycled items because he loves water bottles and stuff like that. Uh, I'm trying to think what I could do. So I looked through this bin and then I also look in here. There's more toys in here, so I looked through this to see like what there is. Like I said, I could do music, music theme, or maybe the sea animals theme. Um, So this is what I kind of do. I get everything that I think I'm going to use for like the theme. This week I can't decide between music and like underwater, under the sea type theme. So I'm kind of checking to see which one would have more toys for him to play with. Um, but I think I'm going to do under the sea because I also have a water bottle and shells. I might do something with that. Um, but I also have this basket with more things. Um, these are for Easter. money um, pizza Christmas book puzzles puzzles I think that's a Christmas book I 
don't see anything in here that I could use. But... Maybe I could do both. Maybe I could do like a Little Mermaid theme. Because Little Mermaid has all the music songs and all that. And they play instruments, right? So I could put like these in there. This one. I don't know. We'll see what I end up doing. Okay, this is the final product of what I came up with. So the theme I kind of went off of, The Little Mermaid. I have a turtle here that I'll bring down for him when he's ready to play with it. Right here I have ducks and frogs. Then right here I made a sensory bag. It has sand and some seashells. Down here I have a frog puppet and a turtle toy, it, like rattles. And then here I have two sensory bottles, one's just water, and then the other one is fake sand. It's actually oatmeal. He doesn't like the oatmeal anymore, so I just kind of used it as sand. And then in his sensory bin, these are those, um, what are they called? They grow in the water. So I'm going to let him see those, how they get bigger. So I'm going to add water to it tomorrow. But right now they're little, so they're just going to hang in there. But, yeah. So that's basically what I do to get his playroom ready and a different theme for each week. I change it every Sunday. So that's when I go ahead and put away all his toys and then bring new toys in. Um, but yeah. So for all you who asked me, I usually look on Pinterest um, for more ideas or I just type in on Instagram like hashtag sensory play, sensory activities, different things like that. Um, and that's where I get all my ideas from. And then I just kind of go through his toys and see what common theme I could find and put them all together. Boom diara, boom diara, boom diara. <gasps> Look at the cute little monster. Slippy, what's up? <laughs> what's wrong? Are you tired? Okay, we're gonna go tonight. Okay, say good night.